Alright, welcome to another, the second episode of our Payback Pay-Per-View, and this is going to be a good one. This is WB2K18, of course, I'm of course Dominic here on the Bad Wrestling Channel, and we're kicking it off here with a, with a matchup I'm pretty excited for. This was never announced, but I was like, you know what, we, Raw needs a secondary championship, so Dean Ambrose decided to make it the Hardcore Championship because it's Dean Ambrose and he's wacky and spooky and all that stuff. Anyways, this is going to be a fatal four-way. Elimination, falls count anywhere, no disqualification match for the for the Hardcore Championship. I know I never announced it, but I don't think I have to. This is just going to be fun. So Eric Young, of Sanity, making his way to the ring. This is going to be pretty fun. Fun fatal four away. Hopefully it goes on a little bit fast. I don't want it to be too long, but you know what? If it if it's long and it has a lot of cool spots, I, I'll dig it. I will dig it. The leader of Sandy right there, Eric Young, gonna go one on one on one on one with first off Randy Orton making his way to the ring. The Viper going after the secondary hardcore championship. We haven't seen Randy Orton, I don't believe at all in our universe mode. So this will be. Pretty fun indeed, pretty fun. Randy Orton, okay, he's new to our universe mode. This is his little universe mode debut. And I'm excited to see him battle it out against Eric Young. Another person that's going to be debuting in our universe mode is the person coming out next. Baron Corbin. Is that, what the, is that how he says it? Baron Corbin? Whatever. Baron Corbin making his way to the ring. I'm really happy he has the old music. At least I hope he has the old music. Hopefully they didn't update the game. Yeah, they do. Okay. I didn't. You totally didn't hear the game in the background. You totally didn't hear me uh, mess with my remote there. You shh, shh, shh. You didn't hear anything. Anyways, there's Baron Corbin making his way to the ring. He is the third of the four men here on 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 Raw. I, I I'm not doing good at commentating stuff. Who cares? Payback Extreme Rules Fatal Four Way. Falls County win match. I'm excited to see this. And who's going to be the last person to fight for the Hardcore Championship? What shall this person's name be? I'm not doing good at commentary. Shut up. Okay? Whatever. It's... 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 It's, it's the Hardcore Legend, Mick Foley. Or should I say Cactus Jack. Although, he's at real Mick Foley, so I don't... Do I call him Mick Foley? I'm going to call him Cactus Jack. I'm going to call you Cactus Jack, because you're Cactus Jack in the game. But yeah, Cactus Jack making his way to the ring. He is here tonight. Like I said, um, we can use people. Okay, just because they're not drafted doesn't mean they don't show up in the universe mode. And I think the hardcore legend Cactus Jack should be a perfect addition to this matchup and potentially to the hardcore title scene on Monday Night Raw. But will he be able to win the matchup? We're going to only find that out in just a few seconds. As we're going to see Hardcore Championship on the line. There you can see the logo. You don't see the belt. Usually you see the belt, but whatever. And there you can see the belt. The old classic Hardcore Championship. Mick Foley helped make great. As Eric Young in one corner, Randy Orton in the other. Baron Corbin there. And then the Hardcore Legend, Cactus Jack. Let's get into it. Eric Young going right after Baron Corbin. Randy Orton going right after Cactus Jack. We all know they have some history there. Randy Orton and Mick Foley. Okay. We all know about that amazing hardcore brawl, and if they, they can get a little glimpse of that in this matchup, then that would be very lovely indeed. As Cactus Jack going after Orton, Baron Corbin seems to be going after him, but no, Eric Young gets thrown into the barricade by Baron Corbin. Throws him hard, da throws him down hard. Does Baron Corbin? As Cactus Jack and Randy Orton having a little bit of a, a little bit of a technical mat technical match. I oh, don't know. Showing some ring presence, I guess. I'm not too sure. Not oh! Big clothesline by by Randy Orton and Baron Corbin and Eric Young seem to be sort of teaming up on Randy Orton. And now what is this? Oh wait, Baron Corbin. Oh, what's about to get belly to belly suplex? Cactus Jack stopped it from happening. Cactus Jack now. Oh, back suplex connected there on Eric Young. And Baron Corbin, look at this. Huge power bomb to Randy Orton. And these all four men just going right after each other, not allowing anything to happen with each other's uh, offensive maneuvers. And now, oh, back suplex is reversed there by Baron Corbin as Randy Orton going after Cactus Jack once again. Yeah, surprising that Cactus Jack has not brought out 
any weapons yet specifically not brought out you know barbie the little the little barbie doll no i'm kidding it's not barbie doll it's a freaking bat dude it is a bat of pure terror for most superstars on the raw roster okay what is this oh deep six by baron corbin beautiful maneuver okay a little selfish in my opinion that he has that move considering he has a freaking the probably the probably the coolest finisher end of days is it the coolest finisher? Randy Orton is the most popular, but I don't know. I think it's the coolest finisher in the end of days, does Baron Corbin. In my opinion. Especially since you can, like, catch in the game. Like, have you seen that? Hopefully we get to see it tonight. Baron Corbin doing his catching end of days. It's pretty awesome. It is pretty great. It looks pretty cool. But whatever. I mean, it does Oh, wait, there he goes! Speaking of the end of days, connects here on Randy Orton. Cactus Jack Aaron Young fighting, the, fighting on the inside. Remember, this is elimination. One, two. No, Randy Orton kicks out at two, showing some resilience there. And now what is this? Oh, God. Baron Baron Corbin beating out Randy Orton. Oh! Off the top does a sidewalk slam by Cactus Jack. Eric Young not looking good. Randy Orton, though, trying to fight back here against Baron Corbin. Okay, Eric Young gets thrown into the corner by Cactus Jack. By Cactus Jack. Okay, so um, if you didn't see the last episode, like I said... We're going to do one yesterday, one video yesterday and two videos today. So this, this is going to be one of the two videos of our Payback Pay-Per-View. And it should be lovely indeed. Lovely indeed. Now look at this. Oh wait. Pile driver by Cactus Jack. You're not going to like this, Eric Young. Oh god, that move's illegal, man. That's how dangerous it is. Look at this. Replay right there. One. Two. No, only a two count there. I thought that was it by that brutal looking pile driver. I thought Eric Young was out of it. And now Randy Orton going for the pin on Baron Corbin on the outside. Will he be able to take him out here? One, two. No, only a two count there by Randy Orton on the Baron Corbin. Okay, surprise. Surprising nobody's really gotten for a weapon except for Eric Young. I mean, Eric Young, the leader of Sandy. I think he'd be perfect as a hardcore championship at least. Considering he's all Sandy. He's like, we should fight each other and stuff. Chaos and... All that stuff. I, I don't know. Anyways, Baron Corbin going after Randy Orton. Oh, God, did you see that by, 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 Cactus, Jack, just, by Cactus Jack? Just throwing him. <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying Cactus Jack like that. But whatever. Baron Corbin, though, look at this. Putting him towards the ring apron. Not the ring apron. The um the barricade. There we go. That's the move. Now, Cactus Jack gets a super kick by Eric Young. Randy Orton now finally going after some form of weapon. Not too sure what he has in mind. He's got a sledgehammer. Randy Orton, he's got a sledgehammer on to Baron Corbin. Not to show he has mine. Now look at this, going for... Oh, beautiful looking brain... I am a fan of a brain buster. I am a fan of a lovely looking brain buster. If you know me, I love me some brain busters. Speaking of, look at this. Ooh, landing on the top of his head. Slash back area. Lower back area, higher back area, whatever you want to call it. One, two, only a two count there on the Cactus Jack. The Cactus Jack. Of course, it's now... Cactus Jack, though, punches him right in the stomach, right in the abdomen. Eric Young, Cactus Jack, what a feud that would be. That's a feud we gotta see in our universe. But of course, only if Cactus Jack was the Hardcore Championship, because, you know, he needs to... Because, you know, he's not really a part of the Raw roster, he's just kind of here. As you saw Randy Orton just throw Baron Corbin into the steel steps, and looks like he's setting him up potentially for an RKO. Setting up for an RKO, oh, it's Cactus Jack with it! Baron Corbin, he was being called out, and then out of nowhere on the cactus, on the cactus jack. One, two, only a two count there. On two, and now Baron Corbin just going right after Randy Orton once again. Baron Corbin now gets thrown across, and Eric Young just in the middle of the ring. Looks like he's taking a shit. Looks like he's taking a dump all over wrestling, all over the ring. <laughs> sure, why not? Whatever. Cactus Jack just recovering. Now, Baron Corbin, look at this. Second end of days on to Randy Orton. And Cactus Jack wants to go take the pin on Randy Orton. Randy Orton just kicks out immediately. Okay, that was kind of weird. Pretty much no selling the end of days, it looks like. And Baron Corbin. Oh! Eric Young hits Cactus Jack with the kendo stick rolling to the outside. He does. Randy Orton on the outside. Baron Corbin going after Eric Young. These two battling it out in the middle of the ring. What's he got in mind? Throws him. On the top, oh god, busting him open. And now Deep Six connects there on Eric Young. But kicks off Randy Orton, not allowing him to do anything. 
He looks like he's going to drag him over to the table. It looks like, no, he takes him down. Randy Orton leaning up on the ropes. Okay, this isn't as, this is not, to be fair, this is not as hardcore as I thought it would be, but whatever, we're just going with it. Cactus Jack getting up finally. Eric Young going to the outside, rolling to the outside, Cactus Jack. What's he got in mind? It looks like he's going to go after Randy Orton. And he does, just brutally beating the crap out of Randy Orton, punching the face, pu trying to punch his face into the ground, it looked like. That's Cactus Jack with a big bulldog to Baron Corbin. And now look at this, the second pile driver. Second pile driver by Bar on the Baron Corbin. Oh, looks brutal there on the Baron Corbin. And that might be the first elimination in this fatal four-way. And it is the first elimination in this matchup. Does, uh, taken by Cactus Jack. And now look at this, what's he got in mind? Not too sure. Gets thrown into the corner. Randy Orton runs into the ring. All three men in the center of the ring. And now, oh, right to the leg there. Now Randy Orton's like, why can't I just fight anybody? I just want to have a match. And now look at this. Oh, he's feeling a comeback being uh, used by Randy Orton. God, I cannot speak today. I don't know why. But whatever. And now look at this. Oh, turns it into the backbreaker. Randy Orton's on fire, ladies and gentlemen, of course. And now methodically kicking all of the limbs of Eric Young. And now, oh, right to the chest. And now... Ooh, once again, stomping on the head, going for the cover. One, two, three. Just brutal stomps to Eric Young, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, RKO out of nowhere on Cactus Jack. RKO out of nowhere. One, two, three. Randy Orton, ladies and gentlemen. Our world heavy, not world heavyweight champion, our hardcore champion, ladies and gentlemen, let's replay some of this, Cactus Jack was looking good against Eric Young, and then, oh, okay, I don't know why they just showed, showed it twice, but okay, brutal knee, apparently, I guess, brutal looking, oh, right in the middle of the ring, with a huge pile driver, deep six on Randy Orton, but of course, Randy Orton just had to come back all of a sudden, okay, eliminating both men in the span of, like, three moves, the leader of Sanity, Eric Young, and the hardcore legend, Cactus Jack, fall to the Viper and the new hardcore champion, Randy Orton. And there you can see him holding it up high. I, I don't know if it's just me, but I think that title might look good around the waist of Randy Orton. Okay. 13-time world champion. Is that, his, is that his number now? 13? Is it 14? I think it's 13. 13 to 14-time world champion. Current hardcore champion. Here I payback. Now let's get on to the main event of this second episode of Payback. And here we go, everybody. One of Raw's main events. Surprisingly, not the Raw main event, but I feel like the matchup, the other Raw matchup, I should say, I feel has been built a little bit better than this one. But you know what? That's just my opinion. WWE Championship is on the line here, ladies and gentlemen, as the second part of our pay-per-view paybacks main event okay and i think this is gonna be remember one more episode coming out probably later today if not at the same time this video came out i haven't decided that part yet um the second part the third part i should say the final part will be coming out later today hopefully or like i said when this comes out you know what whatever i don't know where i was going with that but i'm just going with that shizuke nakamura he's gonna go one on one against the samoan submission machine in samoa joe Will it be the king of strong? Will it be the king of strong style or King Joe himself for the WWE Champion? Let's see what will happen. Who's gonna walk away? Your WWE Champion. As now Shinsuke Nakamura in the middle of the ring, waiting for his for his opponent. Okay, Smojo and and, and you know Shinsuke Nakamura. They've had a little bit of a good feud. Pretty good feud so far. Pretty good rivalry. Okay, Samoa Joe. He just keeps beating down the Shinsuke Nakamura. Shinsuke Nakamura has not earned one single win on Samoa Joe. And he feels tonight will be his night to shine and earn that WWE Championship. Okay, Samoa Joe, though, he's a little bit angry, okay? He does. He feels disrespected after defeating Ty Dillinger in the last episode of Raw. Then being attacked by, by Shinsuke Nakamura. Nakamura basically saying, I'm not done with you just yet. For our WWE World Championship. But yeah, there you can see Nakamura on the outside. He knows Samoa Joe is no easy task. 
He is not an easy opponent to face. And will he be able to defeat him here tonight? Only time will tell. WWE Championship on the line. And there you can see Shinsuke Nakamura. He is all ready. He's all fired up at the payback pay-per-view. Okay, the King of Strong Styles here just rubbing his face for some reason. Saying, showing a little bit of respect. A little bit of respect. Samoa Joe, of course, known as one of the best wrestlers in the world. Which is why he is our WWE Champion. Defeating Nakamura on the first episode of Raw for said championship. In a tables match, I do believe it was, if I can remember all the way back. So this is going to be probably a brutal fight between these two as Nakamura and Samoa Joe. Okay, you know, they've had rivalries all the way since NXT. And it's gonna be this is gonna be pretty fun. This is gonna be pretty fun. Okay, so there you can see. Shit's getting Nakamura. Samoa Joe. WWE champion on the line for Monday Night Raw. And let's get into it. These two are gonna fight out here tonight. Locking horns, these two bulls. Here tonight, Samoa Joe throws him into the corner pretty much. Okay, he's outpowering him, showing a little bit of a test of strength here. Okay, it's now Nakamura and Samoa Joe once again. And now Samoa Joe once again just outpowering Nakamura. The crowd watching on. WWE Championship is on the line. Can't wait to see who wins this match up here, ladies and gentlemen. It's now Nakamura. Oh, elbow. No, no, elbow. Knee to the face. First maneuver of the match. Oh, brutal elbows by Shinsuke Nakamura. And Nakamura telling him to come on, Samoa Joe. He is definitely coming on here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, knee to the face by Samoa Joe. Throws him into the corner. Nakamura does. El knees into the stomach and then a knee to the face there. Nakamura, look at this, telling him he is the king of Raw here tonight. And now, oh, knee to the kind of the side of that, so kind of the armpit area. Okay. A little bit weird, but whatever. Nakamura catches him off guard, though. Samoa Joe down, the WWE champion. Nakamura here tonight, the challenger. This is going to be one hell of a fight, ladies and gentlemen. Now, look at this. Turning into a back suplex. Oh, right into the... Right into the... Into the bottom turnbuckle. That looked brutal. That looked very painful. But Samoa Joe knows it. Now, going right after Nakamura. Nakamura, though, look at this. Reverses the punch of the face with a punch of the face of his own elbow. And again, and again, no. Gets reversed there, Nakamura. Oh, what is this? What's he going for? A power bomb, it looks like. Oh, my God. Oh, what was that? Braun Strongman looking move there. Samoa Joe, I don't think I've ever seen Joe do that move before, but okay. I don't think he's ever pulled that off yet, but okay, let's go with it. Let's go with it. Nakamura, though, look at this. Gets taken down there by Samoa Joe. WWE Championship on the line. On the line. I don't know why I turned the JR there, but whatever. And now, oh, wait. Oh, kicks him in the face there. Okay, catching him a little bit off guard. Nakamura, look at this. Knows he has the matchup in the palm of his hands. He's got the crowd in the palm of his hands, at least. And now, wants to go for a maneuver. Samoa Joe gets reverse. Samoa Joe gets the reversal there, picking him up. Nakamura now looking good here tonight. Gets thrown onto the onto the ropes. It looks like, and then, ooh, gets taken down there by Samoa Joe. Does Shinsuke Nakamura going for the cover one? No, only a one count there. Nakamura now looking good here tonight. Okay, these two, although looking fairly even, Samoa Joe, he seems to be having more. Of the power advantage, as we saw at the beginning of the matchup with the with the locking of horns. Now, oh, right into the barricade. Not in the barricade. Into the ring apron, it looks like, a little bit. Oh, wait, now, oh, just brutal punch to the face. Samoa Joe gets Nakamura down to the mats there on the outside. Just brutally beating him down here. Does Samoa Joe on Shinsuke Nakamura. Okay, he's wrenching on the neck. Count of five. This one might be even a little bit more brutal. Then the matchup we saw just before this one, the Hardcore Championship matchup. Okay, so now throws him into the ring. The count is seven. Nakamura now looking good here. Going for the cover to Samoa Joe. One. No, only a one count there on to Shinsuke Nakamura. Samoa Joe, look at this. He's got all the momentum in the world right now. The current WWE Champion, what's he got in mind? Pulls him into the middle of the ring. Picks him up. I don't know why Shinsuke Nakamura just kind of jumped there a little bit, but okay. Just whatever. Samoa Joe, look at this. What does he got in mind? Not too sure. Going for look, what looks like to be an insiguri looking maneuver. And it does and connects their kick right to the back of the head. Nakamura. Okay, I don't think he knows exactly where he is right now after that one. Punches him in the gut. Or elbows him in the gut, I should say. Catches him, punches him in the face. Grabs him by the gooch. <laughs> I don't know why I said that, but sure. That's what he did. Okay. 
Don't yell at me. With the inverted power slam. I didn't have to look it up. I finally got it down. Are you guys proud of me? <laughs> okay. Sure. Back suplex. Reverse there. Reverse there into a Kinsasha connects there. Samoa Joe down first. Finishing maneuver of the matchup. One. Two. No. Only a two count there by Samoa Joe. Or onto Samoa Joe by Shinsuke Nakamura. Yeah. I, th I, I do believe he thought he had him there in that Kinsasha. But no. Samoa Joe kicks out. Okay, turns that into a reversal layer. What is this? Ooh, big... That, that, they, uh, okay, does that back suplex land on his head? Because it looks like it lands on his head. And that looks very painful. That's not, what is this? Ooh! All of the weight onto the stomach. Now, once again, Samoa Joe! Oh, once again there. Connects. Kicks him in the gut there. Samoa Joe has got control of Shinsuke Nakamura. What does he have in mind? Not too sure. Picks him up. Into a huge maneuver there. I forgot what that's called, but you just go with it. Just go with it. I totally didn't forget what that's called. What are you talking about? I am professional. Nakamura takes down Samoa Joe. Nakamura, now look at this. Kicks him in the side area. Looks like Samoa Joe's down. Nakamura, he's got control. Okay. Just keeps changing control, this matchup does. Okay, first off, it's Samoa Joe. Then it's Shinsuke. Then it's Joe. Then it's Shinsuke. WWE Championship, of course, on the line. Kick in the back there by Samoa Joe to Nakamura. Nakamura, though, he has him in control here. What's he going for? Another powerbomb looking maneuver. Looks like no turns it into that side slam there. I still don't know what that's called, but it looks really cool. That's that's Braun Strowman's submission thing, right? Not submission, signature, right? Looks like it's a signature. Okay. And now, oh, elbow to the face. In the face again. It, well, not really the face, more like the chest. Just go with it, okay? Don't yell at me. You know my real dad? <laughs> that was dumb. That was dumb. That was a dumb time to say that. Anyways, Samoa Joe. Okay, he's out. Power ranks Shinsuke Nakamura here in this matchup. Not allowing him to do any maneuver here. Going for German and he connects. They're going for the cover off the German one. Two. No, only a two count there by Samoa Joe onto Shinsuke Nakamura. Punch him in the face. Kakina clutch. He's got it. And now connects there the Kikina clutch on some on Shinsuke Nakamura. Will he be able to tap out the Simone submission machine he's known for all around the world? Mainly because the submission holds like this. What's he got in mind? Not too sure. Oh, <laughs> headbutt to, to Samoa Joe. Okay, that's a way to get out of it. Now, oh, let's go for a kick. Gets reversed there, though. Nakamura. Samoa Joe, he's got him again. Going for... What? What is this? What? Do you, what is he doing? What is... Th Whoa! What was that? Trying to damage the knees there. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Okay, Samoa Joe going after Nakamura. Right to the shoulders again. Samoa Joe, he's got full control of this matchup. He's had it for some time now. Nakamura needs to find something to get back into this. Is now, oh, went to go for a knee. Reverses there. Going for, not too sure, full Nelson slam. It looks like no. Reverses it. Elbow to the face. Oh, kicks him in the face there by Shinsuke Nakamura. Nakamura, he's feeling it here tonight. What's he got in mind? Not too sure. Waiting for him to get up. And then, oh, knee to the face off the second turnbuckle. Nakamura, he's ready for him here tonight. Shinsuke Nakamura, you do not want to get up now. You do not want to get up. Shinsuke. Let's go for, for the Kinsasha. Gets reversed there. Now Nakamura, what is this? Turns it into the STF. Into the STF by Samoa Joe. Shinsuke Nakamura trying to crawl to the ropes. I don't think he can. And now, oh, gets out of it there, though. And then, oh, throws him to the outside. Probably the smartest maneuver Nakamura could do at that time. Getting a little bit of a breather here. By, you know, throwing him to the outside on the Samoa Joe. Hell of a matchup we're watching here tonight. Brutal looking matchup. What does he got in mind here? Not too sure does Nakamura. And now look at this. What's he going to Trying to go for a kick to the face. No, gets... He just... He doesn't even kick him in the face. He just kind of whatevers. And then just goes with, with, with an axe handle. Fine. Whatever. Who cares? Nakamura, though. Oh, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> just like a little love tap of a knee there. Just like... Oh. <laughs> whatever. Nakamura. He's got Samoa Joe right where he wants him. Okay, that, that was not the maneuver you should have done. That was not the maneuver you should have done. Okay, that gave him a little bit of time to do whatever he needed to do. Suplex connects there, going for the cover. One. No, only a one and a half there. On to Shinsuke Nakamura. Nakamura, though, 
might be in a world of hurt Samoa Joe. I don't think he really, I don't think he really appreciated the kick out I won there. That's not what's he got in mind, not too sure. Has him in between the legs. It's Nakamura, though, gets out of it. And now, oh, knee to the gut there by Shinsuke Nakamura. Nakamura, he's got him down. He's got Samoa Joe down. I don't know why I said, like, down. Like, like Arnold, Arnold Schwarzenegger down. Put the cookie down. I, I don't know. Anyways. <laughs> Where was I going with this? I don't know. Nakamura, though, was this? No, he gets reversed there by Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe going for another one of those power slam things. Oh, no, turns into a power bomb. No, not even a one count. Now turns it into a boss, into a crab there. I, I, it's, <laughs> that's not, that's not how you do a submission hold. That's, that's not how you do a submission hold, Samojo. You're supposed to, you're supposed to play the mini game instead of just staying still. I, <laughs> okay then. I mean, that's pretty much a waste of an OMG moment, but sure. Why not? <laughs> it's, okay, count of two. And now Nakamura, what is this? Going for the inverted power slam and it connects there. Samoa Joe gets taken down. Nakamura, he's got him right where he wants him. Throws him, ooh, right into the steel steps. Just for good measure. Kicks him in the back again and again and again. Not allowing him to do anything. Oh, just brutally kicks him in the face and again and again and again. Just going right after him. Elbow, elbow. And then, oh, let's go for a third elbow. We're gets reversed there by Samoa Joe. Now on the outside going for a power bomb. No, gets reversed there by Shinsuke Nakamura. And now Samoa Joe gets punched in the face. Nakamura needs to run back into the ring. Count of eight. Okay, he knows if he gets a count out there, he will not win the matchup. And he knows that. Which is why he ran right into the ring as fast as he could. But Nakamura, though. Okay, Samoa Joe, he's got control of Nakamura. WWE title on the line. One. No, only a one count there. On to Shinsuke Nakamura by Samoa Joe. Kicks him in the back. What's he got in my ear? Oh, God, you're not going to like this. You're not going to like this. Oh, again, just crushing with all of the weight he has of Samoa Joe. Okay, what is this? Throws him into the corner. Shinsuke Nakamura, you're not going to like this. Gets put up to the top. Turnbuckle, it looks like, and he does. Samoa Joe, you're not going to like this. Going for a superplex. I mean, Shinsuke Nakamura, you're not going to like this. That's Samoa Joe. What has he got in mind? You're going for a big superplex-looking maneuver. And then... Connects there, slams him hard off the top turnbuckle. Shinsuke Nakamura is down. Samoa Joe has him where he wants him, punches him in the face. And now German suplex connects on to Shinsuke Nakamura. And another one. And now I'm going to go for the trifecta. Connects there. Doesn't even go for the pin yet. He knows he is not done with him. Except for, you know, the fact that he goes for the pin there. Thank you, Joe. Thank you, Joe. That really helps. And now only a two and seven eights there. I thought that was going to be a three count. But Samoa Joe, uh, you, he thought it was going to be a three count. Shinsuke Nakamura showing resilience, showing some fight left in him. He's got, what's he got in mind? You're not too sure. Too fast? Are you serious? I mean, reverses doesn't reverse there. Shh. I didn't say anything about, you know, breaking the fourth wall stuff. I don't care. And now, once you go for a punch in the face, gets reversed there by Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe, though. Oh my god, just slaps him in the face. Backhands him. He just starts slaps him in the face, knees him in the face, trying to wake up... I think he's just trying to wake up Shinsuke Nakamura or something. Throws him across the ring. Shinsuke Nakamura just gets a slap in the face, thrown across the ring. And Samoa Joe still does not get the three count. Samoa Joe thinking to himself, what does he have to do in order to win this matchup? And now look at this, going for a big submission hole style maneuver. Now gets a, re gets a re rope break. I'm going to a reversal there. Gets a, re gets a rope break. God, I cannot speak today. I'm very sorry. And now, off the ropes into a big kick to the back of the head there by Samoa Joe. Shinsuke Nakamura, though, takes him down. Does Shinsuke Nakamura. Samoa Joe, though, is down, ladies and gentlemen. Shinsuke Nakamura, I think he's trying to fight back here, ladies and gentlemen. Throws him into the corner. And now, what's he got in mind? Picks him up. Shinsuke Nakamura fighting back. And now the knee to the stomach there. On to Samoa Joe. Shinsuke Nakamura is down. I mean, not Shinsuke Nakamura. On to Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe is down. What's he got in mind here? Going for... Oh, wants to go for the double knees. Wants to go for the double knees there. Punches him in the face. And now once again, going for the trifecta. And again, Samoa Joe. He has it successfully, it looks like. Shinsuke Nakamura trying to fight back, and he just can't do it. Going for a three count there, potentially. One... 
two. And only a two count there, ladies and gentlemen. Nakamura kicking out. Somehow kicking out, punches him in the face. And now the Kakina Clutch. The Kakina Clutch, ladies and gentlemen. He's got it in deep. He's got it in, ladies and gentlemen. Will this be a tap out here? On to Shitsuke Nakamura by Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe, he's got him right where he wants him. He's trying to choke him out here. And he does Nakamura. Just could not get out of it, ladies and gentlemen. He put up a hard fight, but Samoa Joe, throughout that entire match, pretty much kind of dominated him here tonight. Nakamura, though, there you can see, getting up in defeat. Samoa Joe, current WWE Champion now. And now what's going on here? Shinsuke Nakamura. Look at this. Looks like he's trying to shake his hand. No, Shinsuke Nakamura. I think he's just sick and tired of Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe, out of egotist. E egotistical actions, I guess. I'm not too sure. Try to shake his hand. Current WWE Champion now. When, what does that mean? Samoa Joe gets the WWE Championship, ladies and gentlemen. And that's going to be the end of this episode here on our W2K18 Universe mode. I feel like this was a very terrible commentary. Sorry. But yeah, Shitsuke Nakamura losing here tonight against Samoa Joe for the WWE Champion. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we still have one more episode of Payback. And that'll have to be the next episode. If you guys liked it, please let me know by hitting the like button down below. Comment anything you want to comment, subscribe if you haven't already. And if you have, why not hit the bell to be notified of everything we do here on the Bad Wrestling channel. I am, of course, Dominic. And have a good day from Bad Wrestling. Bye-bye. Yo.